John. Hi from Canada, Chicho. I like math now more than 15 years ago. Nice doing some in college. Thanks you for the Jupiter. My pleasure, John. My pleasure. And I'm gonna start live streaming math more. Uh, I'll tell you guys. Should I tell you guys about it now? Uh, no, I'll tell you guys about it later. But I'm gonna start building my math curriculum online because the odds are my connection with the school system here in British Columbia is gonna be severed because the, I'll tell you now because the government has come out and said. Uh, they want biometrics of anyone working with students through a school system, right? And for me, I have uh, some of my work comes from a school that I've been working with for a number of years now, right? I teach a lot of their kids, and they've come out and said the government in British Columbia is doing this to a lot of male teachers, educators, and they want their biometrics, right? And I said, I ain't fucking giving up my biometrics to no tyrannical government. No government, period, and no tyrannical government. All right? Biometric means thing, they, they want fingerprints. They, yeah, fingerprints, Cheryl. So I just found out in the last three months, right? Because another school wanted to work with me and they couldn't because I hadn't built a relationship with them. And I, like, because I've done for 25 years, I've been teaching and I've had criminal record check done multiple times, right? And well, clear, like, okay, I'm Chicho, right? But now the government here has come out and said, uh, from what I understand, they're doing this to, uh, requesting this from a lot of males, mainly males, from what I understand. They want their fingerprints. And I turned to them and said, no fingerprints. I will not give up my biometrics, right? And they said, well, that's the law that the government's passed. I go, well, uh, sorry, I <laughs> refuse to give up my biometrics for a paycheck. I'm going to take a serious hit financially. Just imagine my partner as a nurse couldn't work in this tyrannical state because boop, boop, bodily autonomy first, informed consent first, Nuremberg Code first, right? The government said, oh, you can't work in healthcare even though healthcare is collapsing and we need lots of nurses. Fuck that. We took a serious hit on that front, right? Now they're saying, oh, you can't teach through a school system if you don't give up your biometrics, I tell them, fuck you, I ain't going to give up my biometrics. So I'm not some of those, my students will actually get additional funding somehow from somewhere else to retain my services, but it will most likely be cut in half. So a lot of time is going to be freed up. I'm, I'm going to take a serious hit in pay, like huge. <laughs> like if I wasn't as uh, wise as uh, to who the government is and what centralized institutions are, I would be homeless, right? But lucky for me, I don't centralize my income through one source, right? Even though I'm gonna take a serious set and tighten the belt a little bit, right? So I have to build up my uh, resources coming in from other branches again. And one of the things I'm gonna start doing, the time that's freed up because I won't be able to work with this institution anymore, with the school system anymore, that time I'm gonna start doing live streaming math instructional videos and at the same time doing lump sum writing and building up the modules that we need to build up because this needs to be done pretty quick uh, because in Canada and the Western world, they might require biometrics to access the internet. And if you think that's a conspiracy theory, you haven't fucking been paying attention. So that's what's going on from my front. Okay. So there's a lot of shit that I'm dealing with in the background that uh, I haven't been sharing because we'll see how it all plays out but it's everything that i've talked about before right decentralize yourself make sure you know what's coming make sure who you you know who your enemy is you know who these people are make sure you pay attention to tyranny okay make sure you stand on the right side of history okay